the pattern family if you understand this language well and you can see documents from the wipo uh, which actually explain a pattern family as a uh, same invention or similar invention and that's one way to understand uh, what is the same or a substantially the same invention the other way to understand same invention or substantially the same invention is to go by its priority so if you look at pattern families uh, the epo defines a pattern family as a collection of patent application covering the same or similar technical content okay this is the definition of a pattern family by the european patent office what do they say they say same or similar technical content they say that the, the patents are related through the technical content and the application in a family are related to each other through priority claims so these are the two criteria by which we understand a family one they relate to the same or similar technical content two they are related to each other through priority claims meaning which they have the same or the shared priority at the epo there are two types of patent families one is the docdb simple patent family now this is a collection of patent applications covering the same technical content the technical content is the same then there is an inpa doc inpa doc extended patent family which deals with a collection of patent application covering similar technical content it's not the same it's similar now what are the priorities that the the simple patent family takes into account it takes into account sim first filings the first filing of a foreign application claimed under the paris convention this is accepted when we are talking about the mandate of section 8 uh, there are three international arrangements that comes into play one is the paris convention two is the pct and the three is the trips because some of the provisions of the trips are adopted uh, into the domestic patent laws the paris convention is adopted into the trips so so these are the three types of uh, discussions on patent family that you will find Uh, and apart from this you have uh, provisional first filings because us and for that matter even india a provisional first filing is is what we call a us provisional application so that could also be considered for taking into account priorities in india we have a provisional filing as well so if the applications started as a provisional in india again that will be relevant and interestingly the trans pacific partnership the tpp the tpp has now changed itself into a new form and it's the discussions are going on What i noted uh, is that there is a push to have grace period for all the member countries so all the countries which are a party to the tpp may have if if the proposal goes through they will have some arrangement which is similar to a provisional because they are going to accept grace period so grace period is largely you can make a disclosure and within 12 months you can file a patent application uh, the provisional allows you to do it officially there are jurisdictions which do, do not have provisional but you can still do it unofficially you can make a disclosure in a journal or an approved place it, it could be a conference or a disclosure before a learned society we have that in our uh, chapter on anticipation uh, uh, the transactions of a learned society is excluded uh, from anticipation we find that there is a trend uh, around the world moving towards having a uh, grace period as a part of the law now there is an another priority which the epo recognizes which is equivalence to first filings the equivalent to first filing is a us continuation in part this is on us law in a continuation is in part is like you know you continue an application and abandon the earlier application so that could be treated as a uh, first filing there is some more literature on uh, the patent families now uh, one of the thing you need to understand about a patent family is that whenever there is an application on a same or similar invention where the technical content is the same and which has shared priorities they are regarded as patent families so largely if a company like a telecommunication company or a pharmaceutical major files an application they don't stop with one application they file in all the major jurisdictions so all those applications together will be regarded as a patent family in the wipo classifies patent families as uh, patent families based on priorities which are uh, based on the priority that is claimed and they also have another type of family which they call uh, as a family without priorities okay uh, the priorities 
or the family in which priorities are claimed are national families, uh, uh, filings abroad, PCT convention route or TRIPS family and filings abroad using the PCT system. Now these are the and, and by national family you can understand an application is filed and a divisional comes out of it. So that's a family. Okay, that's a national family. Whereas uh, any international application through the Paris Convention, like a basic application is filed and, and it is followed up in another country, that makes it a convention family. Or you could have a PCT system family. There is an international application and many national phase applications which come out of it. That's together regarded as a family. Now, these are all the priority family because the logic is simple they all have the shared or the same priority. The non-priority or the families without priority are called technical families. Uh, technical families in the sense that, you know, uh, the, the, the priority, they could be improvements over invention. Like we have patent of addition, but patent of addition is still a priority family because the priority is the same. Even if you file a patent of addition or a divisional, the priority remains the same. But technical family is where there are minor improvements, but the improvements are such that they themselves stand as a separate application. But it's like a, a group of inventions that came out of a, of one invention, but from a main technical disclosure, but they had their own different priority. This is largely the classification on uh, patent families.